The physical, spiritual, and emotional trauma I experienced as a child was not in spite of growing up in a Christian household. It's because I grew up in a Christian household. Pastor Paul here in my old hometown of Springfield, Missouri. I'm wearing my Religious Right, Religiously Wrong shirt, which is also the name of my new novel. Hope you can check out the shirts and the novel on my website. A religion that tells you it's better to look good than be good. We need to make ourselves look presentable so that a God out there won't turn his back on us like he did his son. That says, don't get that emotional help, just go to the cross and pray and read the Bible more. That says, fake it till you make it, is a total setup. Because see, when you fake it, you don't make it. I think my father had severe emotional issues and trauma from his childhood, and he was a pastor in a religion that said, just take it to the cross. And he didn't make it, so he self-medicated through food, which he passed on to me, and through being oddly angry at his youngest son, who somehow he saw something in me that made him really angry, that I didn't fit the religious norm, that I didn't live up to his expectation of me as a male son. And he took that frustration out on me and could never admit it because I think it had to be so painful in his soul to know that I was his outlet for his anger. And I believe American Christianity puts that bondage onto people today, which is so sad because I believe the message of Jesus is to set people free from such captivity. And that's the story of Jesus that I want to share with people rather than the one that steals our soul and has us take out our frustrations on one another. The sozo, the salvation of Jesus, is to know your identity and love yourself so you can love your neighbor and be connected to the divine goodness of heaven. I wish someone had been able to tell my father that and even well after the childhood trauma, even just to hear, I'm sorry, would have gone so far in my life. But the beauty of the sozo of Jesus is I get to connect to a love of heaven that helps me be that parent for myself that says, I'm good. And the world is better off with me in it. it says I'm good and I deserve to love myself. And there is no God in the universe who's mad at who I am. And I think that is how we reclaim ourselves from trauma.